Um, do you guys think that when disabled people, uh, it's gonna be fine, everybody rides. Do you think, is that the last, that's the straw? I never said retard, but um, I'm about to. <laughs> Sucks because that guy was laughing. She was upset. <laughs> and all I was gonna ask is if disabled people see each other in public, you think they go, What's up? You know, like, I'm not saying anything's wrong with them. I'm just being inquisitive. I'm not making fun of them, you know? People with born with disabilities shouldn't be called disabled. People who behave like that should be called disabled. <laughs> Going to a comedy show when you can't take a joke makes you a joke and a complete muppet. You're paying to get offended and storm out. What are you fucking stupid? Your ex-husband took half your stuff? Yes. Goat. Uh, <laughs> legend. Uh, I want to shake his hand. Where is this man? I want to shake his hand. Why'd you get divorced? He wouldn't get a job. Oh, this guy kicks ass, dude. <laughs> He's just sitting at home with the kid playing video games. What if I could, babe? <laughs> how much you make a year? <laughs> or how much did you make a year? Quality rules. Sometimes. So the gender pay gap is real, but gender isn't real. Got it. <laughs> got him. We fucking got him. Yeah, can I ask what you're doing? I'm a comedian and we're going and filming for my social media and having a fun. Yeah, not on here, you haven't got the permission. Not permission, okay. Uh, this is the mayor's Because Because uh, I don't want to brag, but the king is a fan. He said, just get out there and have a laugh. Yeah, but this is private land, so you can't have but a the, laugh on but here. The, but the king You can go up owns the top this. over there. But the king owns this, right? Well, so does the mayor, so. Yeah, but the king outdoes the mayor and the king said, film. Yeah, well, on you, my Insta, he said, film. go for it, one doesn't mind. Have a wonderful time do, from do, one. Right, well, GLA own it, so... Yeah, but the king is saying that I can do it. You're saying no to the king? Yeah. Off with her head! Someone said the Salvation Army's getting a bit big for their boots. <laughs> Say, well, you ask a woman what a man want, a woman be like, a strong blah, blah, blah. We ain't never said strong, bitch. I'm not building a football team. Right. <laughs> Of course everyone thinks I'm black. Who in the hell told you that? Vicky, you are as white as I am, and that's okay. We both keep our hot sauce in the refrigerator, fresh batteries in smoke detector, and we're always on time. I beg your pardon? If you ranked yourself on a scale of one to 10, what would 10. you do? Yeah, let's get back to reality. No, I'm in reality. No, no, you're not in reality. I'm you're in reality. Team. You're not in reality. If you're gonna be a 10, we can end this. Because that's not reality. You're not a supermodel. I'm far from ugly, honey. I didn't say that. <laughs> so you I'm made this combative, ma'am. If you really want to say you're a teen, that's fine. But show me where the model contracts are. I don't want to be a model. I, I didn't ask, ask you whether you want to be a model or not. Hey, somebody asked me today. But you're not, you but ma'am, you're not a but you're not, but you're not that. Come on. Okay. Well, you said show me where the model contracts. Somebody asked me today. Oh, okay. do you model? Let's I try no. this. Let's try this again. Where would you honestly rank yourself? I just told you. A 10? Yeah. See, I know that there are men that are more attractive than me. I know men that I'm more attractive than. But I would never, ever think to call myself a 10 because I know I'm not a 10. Is I knew at my, be Is I knew at my best I was never a 10. I knew that. But see, men get an accurate estimation of ourselves. That's why so many of you ladies are well, got triggered because so many women think that you should get something higher than you are. Right, let's try this again and ask her the right question this time. What is your mental age? Yeah. I'm about to walk down the aisle. If he's crying, there's a chance I get the ick. But if he's not crying, I'm gonna be like, why aren't you crying? It's the happiest day of your life. What it do you want? It's not uncommon for a woman to experience competing icks. In economics, we call this a conflict. A conflict occurs when you demonstrate that you are affected by a situation, but also you are icky if you do not do something to demonstrate that you are affected by the same situation. In this case, a man and a woman are to be wed, and if he does not cry, then that is uh, not strong enough of a display of emotion. And if he uh, does cry, then that is uh, too sensitive to the very same emotion. 
This man has worked his entire life to have something to offer this woman for her hand in marriage, and there are only two choices, and both of them are X. There you go. In the case of such a conflict, the woman should be considered unsalvageable as long as both of the X are degree four or worse. Yeah, unsalvageable and in desperate need of Michael. Get some help. Pop the balloon to reject the guy. Again, I can just kind of tell that we just wouldn't have chemistry. That's okay with me. You cool. Mm. You cool people, yeah. And I was Taylor your type? Nah. Okay, nah. why not? Uh, the hat really threw me off, the Willy Wonka thing. I don't really like it like that. Um, really I like the no, no, I mean, I like the dress, the two that's showing okay, right well, here. Okay, well, the nice. back of your head is ridiculous, sir. Ooh, ooh, it's kind of flat. Ooh. If I mean, you want to talk it, about hats, uh, you need I, a hat. I, I'll be honest with you. It's flat, you feel what I'm saying? But I don't really care about the back of my head. I care about the front, but it's all good. You need to have to come for me. <laughs> yeah, Willy Wonka can give it, but she can't take it. Someone said she's not a nine in the USA, and you've already got nearly 3,500 people agreeing with that. And then someone else said, only fans detected, opinion rejected. Hello, I'm JC, I'm 30 years old, and I too am starting over. I was in an eight year long relationship where we had a house, a dog, a white picket fence, but I decided that I didn't want to get married and have kids. So I left that relationship and moved back in with my parents. I was also working a corporate job, you know, 40 hours a week, a nice salaried position. But I decided that I didn't want to work behind a computer for the rest of my life. So I moved to Los Angeles and now I scoop ice cream for a living. I'm also pursuing social media on the side, uh, but I'm a 30 year old ice cream scooper. I've had failed relationships. I struggle with my finances because I work a minimum wage job and it does get lonely sometimes, especially feeling like you're behind in life, seeing your friends get married, have kids and progressing in their careers. But I personally have never felt more fulfilled than by starting over because I get to wake up and feel passionate about what I do every single day. Keep telling yourself that, darling. It kind of sounds like you're trying to convince yourself that you chose the right path and don't hate your life. But you know, if you prefer the cats and ice cream, then good for you. I don't see why you need to make a TikTok about it. You have an ex out there that believes you never cheated on him, but you really did. Yes. 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 <laughs> Absolutely. I'm a hundred, so all my know I cheated on them. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he definitely think I didn't cheat on him, but I did with three different I'm a Scorpio, bitch, they know I cheat. He know I know I cheated on him or not. Yes. Yes. Yeah. I cheated though. And I be crying like I didn't. It's an evil world we live in. It is an evil world we live in, but if she cheats. She belongs to the streets.